So Senator Ted Cruz is being mocked uh, for taking a celebratory selfie right before his team during the NCAA championship lost their game. Oops. <laughs> uh, now, uh, look, uh, Ted Cruz is in favor of Texas Tech, uh, whose championship bid came up short in overtime against Virginia. And so, as I said before, he was getting mocked for taking the selfie. Let me show you this uh, and prepare for the brain bleach. Uh, okay. Hold, hold. Here, here it is. Ted Cruz. Uh, and it's accompanied by the tweet. 35 seconds, one point lead. Go Red Raiders. Hashtag number one defense. Mm, well, let's see uh, what happened. Texas Tech, of course, uh, did not win. Uh, they lost 85 to 77 in overtime. And now Cruz is being blamed for basically jinxing the game for Texas Tech. You gotta love this. Uh, and so Twitter, of course, widely panned him uh, and mocked him. Uh, Mark pointed out that this is a literal cursed tweet. Jameson uh, Fawzer says, Hey, Ted, what happened next? <laughs> Ryan Hopbrook says, Classic Ted. Ruining things since 1970. I would agree with that. <laughs> Ken Tremendous said, This is one of the saddest things I've ever seen. I can't express how deeply sad this makes me. He must have been a Texas Tech fan. Um, Jess Dweck says, Always embarrassing when a politician is caught sending out a dick pic. <laughs> uh, something related to that, by the way. Yesterday, uh, uh, Robert Picardo, he's the guy that plays the doctor on Voyager, tweeted out a picture of Stephen Miller uh, and said, I did, I did it, guys. I, I finally tweeted out a dick pic. <laughs> uh, the Book Viking, uh, getting back to the tweets here, says, now I know why we lost. Again, must have been a Texas Tech fan. Uh, Irma Fernandez says, this is your fault, Ted. Michael D. Nostradam says, I was rooting for them right up until I saw this tweet. <laughs> Alyssa says, the real reason why Tech lost, Rockets lost the playoff game when he showed up too. Apparently, Ted Cruz is just bad luck. Um, Wadsworth the Butler says, It's worth Texas Tech losing. You find in the bright side, of course. Just knowing you'll spend the rest of your night all mopey and sad. Signed, a born and raised Texan. How did Beto O'Rourke, I'm sorry, Robert Francis, lose to this guy? Seriously. More. Um, oh, by the way, I want to give you another tweet here from Ted Cruz. Afterwards, saying, a heartbreaking loss, but an amazing game. Congrats to Texas Tech for a history-making season. Overtime in the national championship, all of Texas is proud of you. Uh, well, not all of Texas is proud of Ted Cruz, just to show you that. Uh, Todd says, someone needs to pay damages for pain and suffering for designing that t-shirt. Uh, again, let me... Let me show you that. <laughs> oh, shit. No, dude. There are some people that should not have beards. Oh, my God. Yeah, no. No, shave that thing off, dude. Whatever that is. That, that is not a beard. This is more like a beard. Uh, anyway, Jay Willis says, Oh, my God, Ted. People can see this. <laughs> and... Then uh, Kyla says, uh, what's even cooler than a pic of me in this teen-style Wrangler shirt looking extremely relatable is they watch uh, the sport of ball from my celebrity seat on the Alps level. Four picks. Also, guns! <laughs> and Kevin Jones finally says something that I think we all relate with. I'm so grateful to not be you. Well, you know what? Again... Always the silver lining. Hey guys, hopefully you enjoyed that free video. Now I'm going to have to ask you a favor. Between the uh, demonetization and the YouTube algorithm messing around with view counts, etc. We're having a hard time adjusting to the new YouTube reality, which is where you guys come in. See, we have a Patreon. Patreon.com slash TYTNation set up to help us rely on the you guys the viewers instead of big corporate ads look 
You know the show. You know how I'm not in favor of big corporations anyway. So help us transition away from relying on the ad model to pay the bills and sign up to be a patron. Patreon.com slash TYT Nation. That goes a long way to help us keep the lights on. And you guys will know that you're supporting independent progressive media.